Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades posted on Monday, 17th of April 2023. The next trade was shared by AR who is trading Nasdaq CFD. As you see the one hour macro chart is showing big red candle and you can see the downtrend channel in the structural 5 minute chart. And using 1 minute chart and algo 1 to 5 he identified good entry and with order flow confirmation he entered and close this with exit statue number one with profit. So thank you AR for sharing your trades with us. The next trades were shared by MG who is trading Dow Jones Industrial Average in form of CFD using a Forex broker. As you see the macro chart of 30 minute is showing downward move but it's very choppy and you can see the structural chart is going down as well and using one minute trading chart he identified several pullback and with setup B he entered three positions and closed and managed them all with profits. So thank you MG for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades were shared by Johnny from New York who's trading S&P 500 futures and here he's trading the E-mini micro and also E-mini S&P and you see the macro chart is in downtrend and also a structural five minute is showing downtrend. So he's trading uh, micro using five minute chart and holding for a swing kind of trading. And for the S&P 500, he's using a smaller one minute time frame to quickly enter and exit with eight contracts. And you can see his trades was already open and he's managing the trades now actively and trying to exit with maximum profit at the support level and he closed this with uh, good profit based on algo one to five and exit strategy number one he also again found another re-entry and open and closed this with quick scalp so as you see his micro contracts are still on and he's managing this and looking for a larger profits and it's trailing the stop now. So thank you Johnny for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades were shared by Jan or Global Instructor who's trading Nasdaq futures. As you see the macro chart is showing a sideways wide range and the price as you see in it also a structural chart showing range expanding sideways but the price got rejected at this point and uptrend is emerging uh, and you can see that in a 10 second trading chart as an uptrend channel that he identified the pullbacks and based on algo 1 to 5 and entry signals he took multiple long positions and close them with profit. We can see the results are showing 100% win rate. So the profit factor is infinite and cannot be calculated as shown as 99. But you can see that the average winning trades were $94 and the largest winning trade was $110. So thank you, Jan, for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades are those I have taken at the beginning of New York market session and the video with explanation was sent to students yesterday. So I'm going to replay the video here for you. Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you my trades taken at the beginning of New York market session today on Monday 17th of April 2023. These trades were taken on Nasdaq and also Russell futures. As you see the macro of 60 minutes shows that during the Monday global session the price was fluctuating around the close of the previous day, Friday, 13,200 on Nasdaq. And during the New York market session, uh, when it opened at 9.30, you can see it continued going back and forth a few times between a narrow range. And so it tested the 13,150 and got rejected and went and tested again 13,200 and got rejected quickly so it was very narrow and volatile range which is not suitable for novice traders to trade it wasn't trendy at the beginning so i took some long position here uh, that was profitable and some uh, long position here that was lost and then we had also some russell uh, long position which was positive so all these long positions mostly uh, became kind of break even for the day and I didn't have time to 
come back and now take this trend i just came back and this was very good to take a long positions and have good profits so i missed that so anyway uh, because it was sideways at the beginning i didn't push it and didn't have time to wait and just came back therefore the result was break even for the day profit factor is about one we had 60 percent win rate and the average win to loss ratio was 0.64 uh, i hope this trade taken by the path system is useful for you and uh, let us know if you have any questions have a wonderful day